The install and deployment changes happened in OES 2018 includes single integrated install media, rebranding and unified update channel. In this video, we will cover each of these install and deployment changes in detail and also why these changes were done and what are the benefits for customers. Let's start with single integrated install media. You might be wondering, what is the difference? Because the integrated install media was already available in previous OES releases and in OES 2018, it's only single integrated install media. What is the benefit? Before we understand this, let's see how it was in previous OES releases. Before OES 2018, three install media or ISO files were available. Separate slash install media, separate OES install media, slash plus OES integrated install media. Using these install media, OES was installed in two ways. First install SLES as a base product and then install OES as an add-on product on top of SLES. Second, install SLES and OES together using integrated install media. Moving on to OES 2018, only one integrated install media is available. OES as an add-on is no longer supported and therefore SLES Mini ISO cannot be used to install OES 2018. SLES and OES is tightly integrated into a single install media, which simplifies the OES installation. The single install media contains only OES product information. Rebranding OES 2018 comes with a microfocus brand. As part of rebranding changes, OES installation screens are modified to provide a new look and done few changes in the install workflow to enhance the install experience. Few sample screenshots of OES installation screens comparing with earlier OES versions. Onboarding screens are newly introduced in OES 2018 to highlight all the OES features. While installing OES, click the slideshow tab to view the features available in OES 2018. Unified Update Channel What is Unified Update Channel? Why it is required? Due to change in customer center, SLES 12 is no longer available in NCC and SLES activation key is not required. Therefore, customer needs to register to only one product, that is OES. More details on the Unified Update channel will be discussed in Registration and Patching Workflow in OES 2018. Before going to OES 2018, let's see how the Registration and Patching Workflow was in earliest OES releases. Two separate activation keys were required to obtain SLES and OES updates. SLES Activation Key to obtain SLES updates and OES Activation Key to obtain OES updates. Both updates were made available through NCC. Before moving on to OES 2018, let's see how the registration and patching workflow will be in the absence of unified update channel. Again, two separate activation keys are required to obtain SLES and OES updates. But customers have to deal with two customer centers, SUSA customer center to obtain SLES updates and Microfocus customer center to obtain OES updates. Moving on to OES 2018 with Unified Update Channel. Only single OES activation key is required. Using single activation key, you can obtain both SLES and OES updates through Microfocus Customer Center. Let's see the advantages of Unified Update Channel. As discussed earlier, customers have to deal with two customer centers. With Unified Update Channel, both SLES and OES updates are made available in NCC. SLES updates typically used to land on OES systems without proper validation from the OES QA team. With OES 2018 Unified Update Channel, all updates including the SLES updates are qualified by the OES QA team before they are made available. 
For more information on install and deployment changes in OES 2018, refer to www.novel.com slash documentation slash open enterprise server 2018. Thanks for watching.